Hi guys, today I'm doing another soap haul video and this one here is from a company, it's called Wicked Sensuals and there's both an Etsy and an Art Fire site. The owner of this company is Janine and I wanted to show you the packaging that I got. I love the fact that Janine uses recycled paper to pack her items, that's really really smart. And here are the items I purchased. The first one I got is Wildfire. And this one, the scent description looked like something that I would really, really enjoy, so I could not finish my order without throwing it in my cart. And check out this awesome packaging. I love her tattered distress labels. She hand tears them across the top. And the packaging is so professional. She lists all her ingredients here in the back. And she puts little holes up here in the plastic so you can smell the item without having to open it. So I thought that was cool and I wanted to show it to you guys. The next one I got is Once Bitten. I've heard a lot of people here on YouTube talk about this soap, so I was really tempted to try that. The next soap I got is Corona with Lime. And this one I could not help but to get. First of all, it just looked really, really awesome on the website, and I love drinking Coronas with lime, so I was really curious what that would sell, smell like. My next item I purchased is the Jolly Green Apple Bubble Blaster, and this is a bubble bar. And I love this. It has really, really clear directions on the outside of the package, just in case you don't know how to use them. She lists all her ingredients down at the bottom, so you can't miss anything. And to my surprise, I saw another one in my order, and this one I did not order. Janine threw this in as a freebie. Thank you so much, Janine. That is so generous of you. And I'm really going to enjoy it because I do take a lot of baths. The rest are free samples that are received in my order, and this one is juicy, and I'm really excited about this because I really wanted to try that. Another free sample was Cali Girl. And this is another popular scent from her, so I'm also really excited about trying that. Look how cute her samples are packaged, very professionally. The next one is Guinness Stout Beer, and that really makes me happy because I purchased the Corona with Lime, and this will probably be my next purchase, so I'm really glad to have the sample to try first. And then the last sample I received was uh, the Butt Naked Body Gelato Foaming Sugar Scrub. Really happy about that. I take a lot of baths and I like to use scrubs in my bath. So that's going to be really, really exciting to try. Okay, guys, I'll be back once I open everything up. Okay, guys, I'm back and I've gotten everything unwrapped. And the first soap that we are going to start with is Once Bitten. And I heard a lot of talk about this on YouTube and I absolutely adore this. This actually is a cherry cola smell and it really does smell like cherry cola. And if you look at the top, it's really pretty. It has a lot of glitter, and I love these labels, and check that out. Look how pretty that is. It's just got like a really nice, pretty swirl in that, and I'm really glad that I got that. And it does definitely smell like cherry cola. And the next one I got was actually just one that I wanted to try. It's called Wildfire. And I wasn't sure if I would like it or not, but look at that. It's got the gorgeous gold glitter on the top. And this one here is really cool. This one here, um, the scent description on this says it's a warm, spicy, woodsy scent. Starts off with cinnamon notes, but it qu quickly balances out by warm notes of musk and vanilla. I love this smell. It just definitely has a wildfire smell to it. It just reminds me if you're like walking through the woods and that smell that you would smell from all the trees almost kind of has a pine scent to me, but not a terrible pine scent. Kind of hard to describe. And the smell of like when there's a fire burning, and I absolutely love this. And this here is the soap. It has a pretty swirl too. I'm not sure if my camera's picking that up, but it's really, really, really pretty. And I like the copper shimmer that's across the top. That really adds to it. Okay, the next one I got is Corona and Lime. And this one here, I don't think I have to explain too much. I love drinking Corona beers with lime. And I absolutely love this. It has a very faint smell, so it's not overwhelming. 
And I definitely think the guys in our life would love this. I think it's for women as well, but I think the guys would totally love these beer soaps. It has a very subtle lime smell, and I can definitely smell the Corona. It's just the perfect scent, so I'm really happy with that. And then the next thing that I got is the Jolly Green Apple Bubble Bar. I did not open this one, but I did open this, and I actually used it last night because I couldn't wait. Look how gorgeous that is. It's a huge bar, too. I cut about that much off of it, and it is just so pretty. I really like the detail on this bar. It just has really nice texture, and I used it last night, and I got a ton of bubbles, and it smelled like taking a bath in Apple Jolly Ranchers. <laughs> it was awesome. And what I'll do is I'm going to insert pictures. I took some pictures of my tub once I put it under the running water, and you guys can see how many bubbles I got out of that. Okay, and then the next items that I got were my freebie samples. The first one is this. It is the Butt Naked Body Gelato Foaming Scrub. And it just has a really, really nice texture. I don't know if you can see that. And it smells really nice. This is the first time I'd be trying the Butt Naked scent. And this seems like a little bit of a more... Um, watery consistent than most of my sugar scrubs but this one is also a foamy sugar scrub so I've never had one of those before so I'm anxious to try that then my next sample was Cali Girl I love this I'm definitely going to be purchasing a big bar of this this is the little sample which I think is totally adorable and it smells so tropical to me I smell mangoes I smell all kinds of wild exotic fruits and it just reminds me of just being in the Caribbean <laughs> and having all these wild fruits around you and it's just gorgeous. Check this out. She even puts the glitter on her samples and I actually can't wait to use this so I'm really excited about that. My next one was Juicy and look how cute this sample is. Really nice detail on that as well. She does the swirl even on the sample and this one is a lot nicer than I thought it would be. I'm not a big perfumey person, but this one here actually almost has a powder perfume smell to it. It's a very subtle powdery perfume scent and I really like that, but if you don't like perfumes you may want to stay away from that, but I usually don't and I love this. Okay, and then my last sample here is the Guinness Stout Beer and look how adorable this little sample is. This is your regular bar and she even makes the sample in the same shape. How cute is that? And this is the sample and it's just really cute. It's the perfect size and it definitely smells like Guinness Stout Beer. <laughs> and again this is a perfect stocking stuffer for the guys in our lives. I think they would really 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 enjoy the beer soaps. And I would actually enjoy them for myself. For myself, I'm going to be using both of these. And I thought that was really adorable. And I'm glad she sent this sample because I wasn't sure about ordering this one. And now I will be because I really do like it. And that was all of my items, guys. Thanks so much for watching. Bye.